Yo, what up, people? What up, people? Today, we're going to react to another video. Uh, top 27 things you need to know about Holyoke, Massachusetts. This is interesting because I'm born and raised there. So I wanted to see if I know any any of them. You know what I mean? And if anybody else knows any of them, let me know. You know, so we're about to get into it. All right. Holyoke is a city in Hamden County, Massachusetts. Yep, definitely. <coughs> the city has a population of 39,880 and let me let you know, this is like two years ago, I bet. Three years ago, so there's probably more. There's probably like 43, 44,000 people. So just letting you know. Sitting eight miles north of Springfield, Holyoke is part of the Springfield metro metropolitan area. Wow, I didn't even know that. Holyoke is part of Springfield. <laughs> okay. Alright. Holyoke is commonly referred to as the Paper City. That's right. The Paper City. Yeah. Holyoke was named after Elijah Holyoke. Yeah, I think that's the dude that lived at the Wisteria Hearst house on Beach Street. And then the other end is Pine Street, so I think that's the guy who lived there. In 2015, the area is a popular mechanics ranked Holyoke as sixth. They consider it to be the best for startups in the United States. Huh. Interesting. The city of Holyoke contains 15 distinct neighborhoods distinct neighborhoods 15 of them wow look at our glorious city hall Holyoke has a total area of 22.8 square miles I mean, it's not that big, but it's big. It's not that big, though, but I love my city. Yes, I love my city. We keep driving. I hope they go down to the flats. Oh, no, nah, he took it and left on High Street. With a crime rate of 59 per 1,000 residents, Holyoke has one of the highest crime rates in America. In America? What? In the state? I understand. But in America? Come on now. That's false. I think that's false. For real. Holyoke is the location of East Mountain, the mountaintop range and mountain time at 1,202 feet on the highest trap rock peak, which I climbed at plenty of times. I used to actually run up that 
mine, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, we are on uh, Maple Street now. Hardwick is also home to the Volleyball Hall of Fame and are known as the birthplace of volleyball. I mean, <laughs> ain't nothing to brag, but I mean, at least we have something in paper. <laughs> There's nothing more powerful than creating a track. But sometimes creating music can be Passenger rail service returned to Hold Up in August 12 and 15 after being absent since 1967. And that's another video we gotta get. For real. Because I have a, uh, I seen one with the railroads driving. And we gotta do that. Holdup is home to the second largest St. Patrick's Day parade in the United States, surpassed only by New York City. Just get it. And, yo, and that shit is fun. Estimate 60% of Hodok is religious, with the largest demographic being Christian, specifically Roman Catholics. Seventeen, the city had the most recipients of SNAP per capita of any in Massachusetts, with thirty-seven percent of residents receiving benefits. Everybody on welfare. We go Sardis Street. We got High Street. Last week of August, the city hosts celebrate Holyoke at Holyoke Heritage State Park. Symphony are originally a project of the Hodo Community College has been playing since 1967. Hmm. I didn't even It was the largest single producer of paper in any city in the U.S., producing around 190 tons per day. Damn. That's a lot of paper. Ooh, you better slow down.
Yeah, that was dope. Uh, let me know if you knew any 27 things you need to know about Holyoke. I mean, a lot of them I knew, but a few of them I didn't.